Good morning. Today we're going to talk about how you get on the expressway. Um, I'm stopped right now. Make sure my mirrors are adjusted. You want to frame the rear window in the mirror. Make sure it's square. Your side mirror, you want to see a little bit of the car. So I'm adjusting it just a little bit. And then the passenger side. Once those are adjusted and you feel comfortable, we have about a half tank of gas, so we're good there. Uh, I've started the car, I'm putting my foot on the brake and I put it into drive. This is rush hour in the morning, so this will be a great tutorial. It's about 20 minutes. I stop here completely, and it's always confusing with these double stops. have to remind you it's about safety. I am hands-free. I promote safety. If you can't see, here's a little cheat. You can let down your window. You always look. You see the brake car coming. Car's coming there. I turn on my left turn signal. I look, I check, and then I go across. People get excited when they wash their cars, so you got to be mindful of car washes. Also, when you stop, you want to see the rear of the tires on the ground. Here's why. If we get rear-ended, we'll have one collision from behind us. Also, I'm in the second turn lane, so when I turn, I'll be all the way over to the left side. And then we share and take our turn. Signal early in advance. It will cut down on confusion and less anxiety. I'm on the outside, this is called the J turn, so I'm on the outside of the J turn. Left turn, yield on green light. So I can turn on red because I'm going onto a one way and I accelerate through the turn. It's very bright in the morning, so you might want to consider sunglasses or putting the visor down. All expressways have an entrance ramp and exit ramp. This is the entrance ramp to the expressway. And this long ramp is where you stabilize your speed. And if you notice the car in front of me, they're starting to accelerate and leave me. In some states of preference, you can cross the white line, but we want to wait for the broken white line. Getting my speed up. Then I want to signal my intention. Mirror, turn signal, blind spot. And I merge into the first lane. Don't hang around semi-trucks. They have four left side right side front and back i'm looking ahead at all of this traffic saying man this is a lot of traffic in the morning but i'm just trying to take my time never cut off a semi truck either and i'm squeezing my brakes there is a bigger vehicle behind me kind of tailgating me so i'm just being mindful you have to drive for traffic in front of you. You can control the traffic in front of you, but you can't control the traffic behind you. The truck is to my left. This is a typical traffic jam here in the United States. They have them around the world. So you have to pack your patience. Obviously we have a half tank of gas, so that's good. It really depends on what time you leave. If you leave just before rush hour, rush hour is anywhere from 6.45 to about 8.30, 3.30 to 5.30, you will have this slow moving traffic, but you're looking for gaps. As you can tell, we're starting to pick up. flow is starting to pick up. I'm going to make a lane change to left, mirror, turn signal, 
blind spot. And you want to be mindful because all of a sudden the traffic can just stop. And that is extremely, extremely dangerous. The middle lane is the smooth lane, so I'm now in the middle, which 